Friday, January 29, 2010. Today, the former president of Poland and Solidarity Union leader Lech Walesa came to Chicago to formally announce his endorsement of Republican Adam Andrzejewski. Mr. Andrzejewski is currently seeking his party's nomination in the Illinois gubernatorial primary. Founder of Solidarność, freedom fighter, brought the end of communism, friend of our president who was born right here in Illinois in the small town of Dixon, Ronald Reagan, friend of Pope John Paul II, and through his leadership and his political courage, brought down the specter of communism without firing a shot. Without further ado, President Lech Valenza. President Valesa explained why he has chosen to publicly support the young candidate's self-described outside bid for governor. As a matter of fact, this is the first time when I'm so strongly supporting someone. But here I feel the grand chance, great chance for this region and for Poland. Uh, the world today needs some order, needs the values. The world needs solidarity. The new solidarity. And I see this in Mr. Andrzejewski. I dlatego go wspieram, bo wiem, że czasy tego wymagają. Jestem całkowicie przekonany. And this is the reason I support him, because I believe that our times require that. Przecież wszyscy widzimy układy, towarzyskie, jakieś, jakieś korupcje, jakieś wspierania się nie, nie, nieformalne. We all see that uh, systems corrupt, informal activities in the back rooms. Ludzie widzą to. People see that. Ludzie chcą trochę porządku, trochę sprawiedliwości więcej. People want more justice, people want more order. I to wszystko widzę w panu Andrzejewskim. And this is what I see in Mr. Andrzejewski. I dlatego go popieram. And this is the reason I support dlatego him. Dlatego będę prosił o to do rotacji mojej poparłej. Now the president, in his endorsement of you, uh, lauds your ability to bring change, your drive, your, your drive for change. What, uh, what needs to change? In uh, I think here in Illinois, as a Republican versus the heavy Democratic majorities in the Illinois General Assembly, we have the fewest numbers, if you could believe this, of Republicans in the Illinois Senate since the Civil War. So we nearly have no voice at all in state policy. So as governor, as a Republican, I would be a check. I would use it, the executive check on the legislative branch in two ways, two executive orders. One, I open up their spending. Show me the money. Put every dime online in real time. That's my phrase for transparency. Barack Obama ran on it and he lied to you. I'll open it up from the top of the appropriation down into the subcontractor level where the systemic corruption exists. The second executive order is the toughest policy in this gubernatorial race. And I can bring forth this policy because I am an outsider running against five insiders that have been there for 100 years. And Illinois quite evidently is not working well. So the second executive order is a forensic audit from the Tap from the uh, $55 billion budget. Uh, I didn't invent it. A Kansas Democrat did it. And she saved her taxpayers a billion dollars. In this race, it's not even in dispute. Illinois can save three to five billion dollars on a forensic audit. It's a deep audit. It's an evidentiary audit. It actually follows the money. And if you think about it, it's how we caught Al Capone. You follow the money. So we could save three to five billion dollars and defend the hardworking taxpayers and entrepreneurs in this state. We could start to pay our bills on time, but we'll also go a long way toward ending public corruption at the state level. I'm committed to that. This is the reason when I heard of Mr. Andrzejewski that he's uh, telling similar things like as I do. I decided to support him. Mamy dużo podobieństw. We are alike in many aspects. Ja zaczynam też taki chudy byłem, jak zaczynała władza. When I started, I was as thin as he is. Świat musi uzgodnić wartości. The world needs to coordinate its values. Świat musi być budowany na uczciwości. The world needs to be built on honesty. A Stany Zjednoczone jest jedynym są supermocarstwem. And United States is only one superpower. Dziś przewodzą światu. Today they lead the world. Nie ma nikt wątpliwości. Nobody has the doubts about it. Militarnie. Militarily. 
Przewodzą ekonomicznie, choć słabną. They also lead economically, but they're getting weak. A nie przewodzą moralno politycznie. But they don't lead morally and politically anymore. Świat nie ma przywództwa. The world has no leadership. Stany były zawsze ostatnią deską ratunku dla innych narodów. The United States was always the last resort in hope for all other nations. To była nadzieja, gdziekolwiek się źle działo, zawsze można na Stany by uliczyć. That was the hope. Whenever something was going wrong, one could count on the United States. Dziś straciliśmy tą nadzieję. Today we lost that hope. Dziś mamy nadzieję właśnie w panu Andrzejewskim i tym pokoleniu, które stawia na wartości. Today we have hope in Mr. Andrzejewski and this, uh, his generation, which puts in uh, one more time uh, pets and values. Addressing an American audience and telling them that their country no longer leads the world politically or morally is some pretty tough love. We asked the president if he thinks America is in even deeper jeopardy. From an outside perspective, from somebody who has witnessed communism up close, is is there a justifiable worry that America is beginning to move towards more towards socialism? No, tak. Ta sprawa bankowa, ta pomoc, ta pomoc, ta inna, to, to trochę nie jest ten kierunek. Yeah, it it leads a little bit like that issue with those banks. Uh, so this is indicates that it's a little bit in this direction. It's not right. Wielkie wyzwania, opiekuńczość. Yeah, those big challenges. The uh, 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 state of taking care of, of people. Jako tematy to są bardzo pchytliwe i dobre. Well, like, like a subject for, for discussion or political tylko, campaign, they are good, but... Tylko, że jak się państwo za to bierze, to strasznie rozbuduje biurokrację. Masę pieniędzy topi biurokracji. Nie but when the government starts doing it, it basically uh, uh, puts a lot of money in it and wastes it. I dlatego tu są te obawy. And those are the concerns. Bardziej prywatnie lepiej lepiej bronią, lepiej oszczędzają, mądrzej gospodarzą. The private entrepreneurs, they are more fragile, they are wiser when managing the money and running the economy. Państwo wszystkie pieniądze zniszczy. The government will waste all the money. Robi się, bo biurokracja buduje się. They just build the bureaucracy. Sama dla siebie. Just for itself. Dlatego tu ostrożnie ten kierunek, bardzo trzeba ostrożnie. So we have to be very careful in following the direction. Opiekować się ludźmi trzeba. We have to take care of people. I służby zdrowia, i inna pomoc. Health care and other help. Tylko, że uważać na biurokrację. But we have to pay attention to bureaucracy. Uważać na straty finansowe różne. Look for the financial waste. Lepiej, jak człowiek sam broni siebie. It's better when the individual takes care of the defense him or herself. On wtedy dobrze wydaje. And when he has the money to do it, and he spends his money right. I dlatego tutaj zauważamy te lekkie skręcanie. And we see that light twist in America. Ale nie pozwolimy wam komunizm budować. But we will not let you to build the communism here. For founding bloggers in Chicago, this is Andrew Marcus.